Hello and welcome to the Body Journal. The kidneys are a pair of bean-shaped organs located in the back of the abdomen. They filter waste products and excess fluid from the blood, which are then excreted from the body in the form of urine. They help regulate the body's fluid balance by controlling the amount of water that's excreted. Kidneys help regulate the levels of electrolytes such as sodium, potassium, and calcium in the body. But as you age over 50, you may start doing things to hurt your kidney that you may not be aware of. In this video, we'll be talking about six of them. Let's get started. Let's get started with number one. Dehydration. Dehydration can be harmful to the kidneys because the kidneys need a sufficient amount of water to function properly. When the body is dehydrated, the kidneys have to work harder, which can damage their delicate structures over time. Dehydration reduces blood flow to the kidneys. This can impair the kidneys' ability to filter waste products from the blood and maintain fluid and electrolyte balance. Dehydration can increase the risk of kidney stones, which are hard mineral deposits that form in the kidneys. It can also increase the risk of urinary tract infections. When the body is dehydrated, urine output decreases, which can increase the concentration of bacteria in the urinary tract, leading to infection. So what should you do? Make sure you're drinking enough water. A good way to tell if you're dehydrated is to look at your urine, if it's dark yellow, then it's a sign that you need to drink more to get it to be a lighter yellow. A good rule of thumb is to drink half an ounce of water for each pound you weigh. For example, if you weigh 150 pounds, aim for 75 ounces a day which equals 9 cups. Number 2. Overusing painkillers. When you get over the age of 50, many people start experiencing aches and pains in some aspect. Painkillers, particularly non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs like aspirin, ibuprofen, and naproxen, can harm the kidneys over time. They can reduce blood flow to the kidneys by constricting the blood vessels that supply them. This can reduce the kidneys' ability to function properly and increase the risk of kidney damage. Prolonged use of these drugs can cause inflammation and scarring in the kidneys. Overusing the drugs can lead to a temporary loss of kidney function and increase the risk of developing chronic kidney disease. Don't be afraid to use these drugs if you need them, but be cautious and stay within the recommended dose range. Consider using other pain relief methods such as heat therapy and physiotherapy. Number 3. Uncontrolled High Blood Pressure As you age, especially over 50, the likelihood of developing high blood pressure grows. Uncontrolled high blood pressure can be harmful to the kidneys because it can damage the blood vessels in the kidneys and reduce their ability to function. Their ability to filter waste products from the blood and regulate fluid and electrolyte balance can be reduced as well. High blood pressure can also cause proteinuria, which is the presence of protein in the urine. This occurs because high blood pressure can damage the tiny blood vessels in the kidneys, which can cause protein to leak into the urine. It can cause scarring and inflammation in the kidneys, which can lead to chronic kidney disease or even kidney failure. If you've been prescribed blood pressure medications it's important to take them as prescribed to keep your blood pressure levels down. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to like, subscribe and turn on notifications. It really helps get our content seen by others who can learn from it. Now, back to the video. Number 4. Smoking. Smoking can be harmful to the kidneys because it can damage the blood vessels in the kidneys and reduce their ability to function. Over time, this can reduce blood flow to the kidneys, which can impair their ability to filter waste and maintain fluid balance. Smoking can increase the risk of kidney cancer, because smoking can damage the DNA in cells, which can cause them to grow and divide uncontrollably. It can also increase the risk of glomerulonephritis, which is when the tiny filters in the kidneys become inflamed and damaged. Kidney stones are more likely to develop because smoking increases the acidity of the urine, which can promote the formation of stones. Continuous smoking exposes the kidneys to stress and should be stopped promptly. It's important to quit smoking to reduce the risk of kidney damage. Number 5. High Sugar Diet A high sugar diet can increase the risk of developing type 2 diabetes, and diabetes can damage the blood vessels in the kidneys. It can increase the risk of developing high blood pressure, which can have a similar effect on the blood vessels. A high sugar diet increases the risk of obesity. Excess body fat can cause inflammation and damage to the kidneys over time. It can increase the acidity of the urine, which can promote the formation of kidney stones. It's important to maintain a balanced diet that is low in added sugars to help protect the kidneys and overall health. And finally, number 6. High Sodium Diet. 
A high sodium diet can have negative effects on the kidneys. Sodium causes the body to hold on to water, which can raise blood pressure and increase the workload of the kidneys. It increases the amount of calcium in the urine, which contributes to kidney stones. The American Heart Association recommends consuming no more than 2,300 mg of sodium per day. Okay, so those are six things you need to avoid in order to save your kidneys. What did you find surprising on our list? If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss our next video. Thanks for watching and you can add these tips to the next chapter of your body journal.